Okay, so um, this is Pascal. He's crazy. He's getting bigger. He's still like three pounds, whatever. He's a year old. Um, let's review some uh, whatnot sellers. Yo, yo, and Emmy's back in the tub. <laughs> if you're new here, my name's James, and this is DC Animal Pops. <laughs> All right guys, so I'm back. Um, I didn't do a video last week. Kind of, there's just so much going on, right? We had uh, Comic-Con in San Diego. If you don't know, I live by San Diego and I did not go. I had to work, I had to do a lot of work. It just wasn't feasible for me to get there. So I did do Disneyland yesterday um, and then I worked today, so I'm quite tired. But, uh, so here's my contribution, all right? My Darth Maul hat. Yeah, it looks pretty silly, but it's cool when you're walking around Disneyland. It's hideous. Maybe not. Anyways, I got boxes from Jay Novo. Surprise, like I haven't done him before. But Photo Boy Pop Shop. Photo is what he's known by. Um, I went into his stream and tried my luck again uh, on his mystery boxes. I've done it two or three times. Very good. I see him a lot in other people's streams, always winning. The guy's a winner. So let's check it out and see what we got. All right, so here's the box. I think there should be should be two pops in here. Pascal. I love that damn dog. Pascal's trying to eat my hat. Okay, Pascal. I'll be silly. I'll wear this hat. I get it. It looks like something that you'd want to eat if you're a dog. But anyways, um, I don't remember the price point for a photo, but they're usually around 20, 30, dollars 35 dollars and um he had quite a few hits and misses not misses but uh <laughs> that looks stupid many many hits maybe it's just me wearing the hat that looks stupid i don't know but anyways um did i hit did i miss son of a packing peanuts i try to get rid of packing peanuts <sighs> every chance i get so if you buy from me, you're going to end up with some pack of peanuts. Um, all right. There is some candies in here. I do love these little strawberry candies. And a photo, sh photo boy uh, sticker. So, yay. All right. So he wraps it in bubble wrap. That's from the post office. Very convenient. I didn't even think about that. Because they have those bubble mailers. And just wrapped it in that. Ooh, now I remember what I got. Um, it's not two pops. But I traded my pop in for this. And this one's cool. It's got a little mark on it. I saw this movie when I was 10 years old for my birthday. So it must have been a December um, Christmas showing. It's Chief Brody. You're going to need a bigger boat. It's not that big. See? I mean, let's monster hands. Whew, a rough one. Jaws. Brody. Love this movie. There he is, Chief Brody. That's a cool one. I, I dig anything Jaws, that's cool. Kind of swore off buying pops, especially during Comic Con, because they go crazy. You get a whole bunch of new pops out, and um, everybody's just paying out the booty on that. So I said, I'm not going to do that. But once that was done and all the sellers got back home and started doing things, I still said, I'm not buying any. I got four boxes over here full of pops. So let's check it out and see what we got from Jay Navo. You got to be kidding me. First one, um, these are like White Elephant. He plays White Elephant where um, you could, um, depending on where you choose at, you pick a number. You can open your number and if if, if you like it, well. And what the hell is he saying? God dang. I think he knows. You open your box and you get what you get, right? I don't think he knows anything. And it goes up on the wall. And the next person goes, and they can be either steal your pop, and they're done, and then you get to open their box, and then so on and so on until you steal someone's pop. Once you steal a pop, it's yours. And then at the end, he has the name of the winner, um, the winning pop, up on top of one of the grails, pulls it off. I'm confused. And if you happen to have stole or held on to a certain pop, that's called... 
you win the grail. I did not. He's just an idiot. It's Bryce Harper. So cool, Pop. Um, I feel like he's destined to be a uh, Hall of Famer. Uh, but who knows? I guess we'll see. And then this other Pop that's in here, it's Dwight Schrute. Um, I really don't like Office Pops. I chose this because I thought maybe this was the winner. There you go. That's the first box. Second box. This is, again, White Elephant. First pop. I just saw Deadpool Wolverine, and this just happened to pop up, X-23. This is the Toys R Us exclusive. Pretty cool. So I chose that one, and then I love some Freddy's, so I chose a Freddy. Don't really like these pops, but this show is coming back here very soon. It's Squid Game's Freddy. Right, he's uh, which one is he? It's a four thousand piece blacklight battle as masked manager. I don't know. It's one of the Squid Games guys, but that's cool. I don't have any of those because I stayed away from the Squid Games pops. But I do love me some Freddy's, and uh, that's a cool one. So then we moved on. We played another game. Um, I don't know if this was all the same day because typically he runs three rounds. It could have been. Might not have been. But the fact is that oh, I got some pops. And there was some grails up there, and I'll be honest, I didn't hit the grail. But there was one I really wanted, so I just paid outright for it. He gave me a deal, and I paid outright for it. This is not it, but this is still a cool one. It's Trix. Trix Rabbit, right? Yep, Trix Rabbit. And now, um, they did a reshifting of prices on PPG on the... Uh, Hobby DB prices um, came down to more of a re reality <laughs> instead of the inflated prices. Um, and this is one of the ones that took a hit. I couldn't tell you exactly how much it is, but I will look it up and see if I can post it right here somewhere. All right, so that's that one. This one's cool. I have this one, but not the con exclusive. This is Toy Story's Army Man. That's the Emerald City Comic Con edition from 2018. Pretty cool. I dig it. Love me some uh, Toy Story and an actual con sticker. Pop. So, And then the one I had to have that I paid outright for. Um, I love Fantastic Plastic. And this is a... <laughs> this is a Freddy Funko as... Um, the Amazing Carlos. This one glows in the dark. I can't see if I can't get it to glow for you and um, post it up here somewhere or wherever. But, I mean, I love how different this is. Those fantastic plastic have their own characters. And this is an NFT glow in the dark 2000 piece. Love it. And finally, I have one more box from Jay Navo. This one wasn't White Elephant. This was a straight mystery box game. I think uh, he had 100 boxes and 20 big hits or 20 hits. So the first number I chose, 10, was a hit. I was like, yes. You don't really find out what it is until the end. Second pop I chose was... Shira. This is like a $10, $15 pop. Glow in the Dark Specialty Series. Shira. I think I've had this one before. Uh, not bad if that's what you're into. I'm not into it. That's what I got. And the third one that I picked was Eric Draven from The Crow. This is a cool pop. It's a newer version. It's Eric Draven with The Crow. So, um, I, I dig this pop. This one's going to be going to my son because I know he loves the crow. So there you go. And then after it's all done, so out of 20 hits, it came down to the last two hits and my name still wasn't called. I did get the second hit, not the top Freddy for 500 or 700 or whatever it was. But I did get the $240, $260 Yadier Molina. I just had this one. There are a couple videos back you probably saw me pull this one. But look how beautiful this is. I was kind of bummed when I sold it. But um cuz I'm I'm not necessarily a St. Louis fan, but I'm a baseball fan. This thing is fire. It's a 400 piece stadium Bush Stadium exclusive. 
That's insane. This video is off the rails because I got a dog, a baby, my neighbor's van is making noises. What the heck is going on? All right, that's all I have for you today. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, be good, be well, and thanks for watching.